Hoppers. It's Friday. It's Mrs. Green again from Edna, and we have learned lots of cool things about frogs this week. And I thought it might be fun if we end our week by making a menu for a frog. Can you imagine going into a restaurant where they serve frogs? <laughs> well, we're going to be talking about foods that frogs like and foods that frogs do not like. <laughs> We're going to decide if a frog would think something was yum or yuck. All right, the first thing that might go on the menu is a salamander. Salamanders are slimy. They're amphibians, just like frogs. That means they spend part of their life, their beginning part of their life in the water, and the rest out of water mostly. Do you think a frog would like to eat a salamander? Yes, they would think it was quite delicious. So we'll put it over on the yum side. How about a fly? Did you ever try a fly? <laughs> Me either. What do you think they would think of a fly? I would think it was yuck, but a frog would think it was mighty tasty. They have very long tongues to catch flies. So we'll put it over on the yum side. Ugh, chocolate cake. Chocolate cake sounds good right about now. What do you think? Do you think frogs would lick the icing off first? I don't either, because frogs are carnivores. Remember, they only eat meat. So we'll have to put this over. Frogs think it would be quite yuck. Ooh, how about worms? Think about worms for a minute. Hmm, they'd be wiggling around when they were trying to eat it. Do you think a frog would like that? Yes, they would. They would think it was quite yummy. So we'll put it on the yum side. Wait a minute, there's a frog. Will frogs eat other frogs? Yes, they will. If the other frog is small enough to get in its mouth, it certainly will. We'll put it over with the yum side. How about the sunflowers? Have you ever eaten sunflower seeds? Yeah, well, frogs are carnivores, remember? And sunflower seeds are plants. So which side will it go on? Yeah, might as well put it over with a cake. No frog would be interested in that. <gasps> it's a mouse! Look at the mouse! Oh, I'm so afraid of mice. Do you think that a frog would eat a mouse? It'd be pretty hairy, right? <sighs> but they would think it was quite delicious if it was small enough to eat because it's meat. So we'll put it over here on the yum side for frogs. Oh, that's a pretty moth. Almost looks like a butterfly, huh? Do you think? that a frog would think that was a tasty thing to eat, or yuck. Did you say yum? Yes, a, a moth is a kind of insect and it's meat to them, so they would think it was quite good. <laughs> so there you have it. There's a pretty good menu there on the yum side. Ugh. And over there on the yuck side, those are things that humans would eat, not frogs. I want you to imagine for a minute that you are a frog. Do you rub it? Rub it, rub it. Which one of those things would you think you'd want to try? Remember, you're a frog, not a human. Did you say the worm? Did you say the fly? <laughs> I don't know. Whatever it would be, you would be like, yum, yum. Hey, if you get a minute and you want to, maybe you could even draw a frog menu for yourself. If you have time, maybe you can offer it to a frog that lives in your house maybe a pretend one. Well, I've had a lot of fun with you this week learning about frogs, and maybe you can remember a frog fact and share it with someone in your family. Well, until next time, have a happy weekend. <laughs>